so it's got all of these sensitivities. I know it's hard, but you're gonna learn it, young one. So this is the autoscope. You know how to use it. You've been to medical school. Hey there, young whippersnapper. I know you've been doing a great job. Are you ready to see the patient room 200? Yeah. Great. Go on out there and show me what you can do. Excuse me, sir. What patients would you like me to see today? <sighs> All right. Listen carefully. I want you to see the patients on rooms 200, 143, 156, and 178. These patients are all on separate wings of the hospital, which means they're on opposite sides. So I hope you brought some comfortable shoes. Then I want a presentation on each of these patients. What are their major problems? What are their minor problems? What are problems that they have that they don't even know about? I want to figure out every single thing about these patients. I want to make sure you know what you're missing. I want you to figure out what I'm missing. I want you to figure out what the nurses are missing. I want you to figure every single thing out about this patient. What does he do on his free time? Why does he do it in his free time? What's his job? Why doesn't he have a job? Why does he smoke? Why doesn't he smoke? Tell me everything. It's 7 o'clock right now. I want this by 10 o'clock sharp. Your ass better be standing right there with a goddamn pristine paper ready to present to me. Do you understand me? I... Okay, that's great. Now get on out of here. Go, 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 go. I don't see you running. Go, go. So, doctor, I was wondering if it would be possible for me to ask you a question? Of course, of course, young whippersnapper. Medical students should never hesitate to ask any questions. Now go ahead and ask away, son. Uh, sir, if you had time, I had a quick question about CHF. Uh, I guess I have time, yeah. What's your question? Um, thank you. For patients with CHF, why do we measure their weight daily? Why do we measure? Why, why, do, you, why do you think? Why do we measure their weight daily? Uh, but that's literally the question I just asked you. Yeah, you asked me and I'm asking you back. Why do we measure their weight? Uh, but... Well, okay, look, what you're going to do is you're going to go home. You're going to get a presentation ready for me tomorrow. I want all the four stages, NYHA, do you even know what that stands for? No, you don't. So go and tell me all the four stages, how you treat each of them, what do you do, what's wrong with them, what's wrong with you, what's wrong with anybody around here, and get that all sorted out and come back. Sir, so why is that such a high priority? You're failing this rotation. So yeah, that's what I think the patient has, and I mean, I would recommend treatment with metronidazole, but I'm not too sure. Amazing presentation. Everybody give it up for our young medical student here. So amazing student here. He's one of the best. Thank you so much for the presentation. And of course, that is the correct treatment. I would just add, you want to mention any allergies the patient may or may not have. And other than that, it was fantastic. Thank you so much. And uh, you taught us all something valuable here today. Doctor, are you ready? You said 10 a.m. for the presentation? Uh, yeah, you know what? Just give me uh, 10 more minutes. Give me 10 more minutes. Go off and uh, screw off for 10 more minutes, please. Uh, no problem. So, uh, are you ready for the presentation uh, now? Yeah, yeah, hold on. Just give me, uh, give me a few more. Give me a few more minutes. A few more, so that's like... That's uh, like a few more. You know, like a few more, a few more. You know, just piss off for a little bit. A few more. Okay. Hey, doctor. Look, it's been like 30 minutes. And so the treatment should include amoxicillin, clorithromycin, and metronidazole to, and also repeat testing for H. pylori to make sure the infection is cleared. Good, 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 uh, good. Um, yeah, we need to work on the structure of your presentation. I told you before, you know, put the review systems before the physical, but you just don't seem to be correcting it. Just, we need, to, we need to work on the structure, unfortunately. Last week, though, you told me to put the review systems after the physical. Uh, look, you, you're just going to need a little more practice, and just keep at it, keep practicing, and, uh, and uh, yeah, we'll, we'll, get you, we'll get you up to speed. We'll get you there someday. Okay, right, thank now. you. Get on out of here and practice. Uh, hey, doctor? Yes, of course. Uh, I was wondering, I've seen all my patients for today, and is there anything else you'd like me to do? No, no, you've done everything you've needed to do today. You've done such a fantastic job. I'm so proud of you, young whippersnapper. Thank you so much for your hard work today, and why don't you just go home, get some rest, relax, study, and we'll see you tomorrow. I'm so proud of you. I'm looking forward to see you tomorrow, young whippersnapper. Thank you. Great job. Everybody give it up for this young whippersnapper right here. Fantastic medical student. Fantastic. Thank, you, Thank you. Thank you. We'll see you tomorrow, young whippersnapper. All right. See you tomorrow. Great student. Great student. Hey, doctor. I uh, saw my patients for the day and whatnot. Is there anything else for me to do? Uh, no, no, there's nothing to do. Just, uh, you know, go ahead and sit in the corner over there and just study, maybe, until something happens. Okay.
All right, thank okay, you. Okay, go for it. Hey, doctor, I uh, went ahead and uh, read the whole textbook. Uh, anything else for me to do? Uh, no, that's great, but uh, no, there's nothing else more for you to do, but uh, you can just get back to, you know, studying until there's something to do for you. All right. Yeah. Get comfortable, buddy. Hope you got a pillow. Some jammies. All right, sir, you know, it's been about a couple hours, a couple hours, you know, half the day. I'm studying. Anything else for me to do? It's 5.30. Uh, yeah, you know what? There is something to do. Let's go over everything about chronic kidney disease and all the stages and how you treat it and all the medications. It's gonna be a great time, you know? There's no better time to start than right now. Um, is there a reason we started this at 5.30? All the other teams went home and we've been doing nothing for the past, you know, five hours. Why didn't we do this earlier in the day? You know, there's just something special about five o'clock where the student's supposed to be leaving I just want to keep them there because education is so damn important. Let's just continue. How about we on. just, I go home and you get your rest. You've been working so hard today. Let's get a rest. How about I fail you and you go home forever? <laughs> what do you mean forever? <laughs> I think that's fine. <laughs>《Sir, why? Why are you gonna fail me?》<laughs> <laughs>